What's up guys, it's your boy Steven Storm right here and this is Eclipse Records. Welcome back to my channel. Have you ever looked at some film or some music video and really admired the kind of color grading that was done on it? I know you have and today I just want to show you how you can instantly copy a color grade from your favorite film or your favorite music video and use it in your films. This is a powerful way that you can just copy the grade and use it in your film. So right away let's jump into speed grade. Have your speed grade installed in your computer. I think Adobe nowadays hasn't linked speed grade since I think they stopped uh, uh, the production of this kind of software. But have your speed grade. If you don't have it, search for it in the internet. Right away click new speed grade project. Let's name this project tutorial lat tutor real lat cuz we are going to export this as a lat and which in which we can use it in our film so i'm just going to go ahead and save it in my desktop and right away as i have opened up a new project so i'm going to drag my screenshot on the on the timeline here if you have a a, a short clip you can also drag it there it, or or just a screenshot you can drag it there so uh after that i'm going to click color and right there i can see my screenshot that's me trying to explain some point on my previous tutorial and this was shot in log and i exported this frame in premiere pro right before i color graded it so uh one of the things that you want to go ahead and do we are gonna like just uh, minimize this and uh, you're going to go to the internet and search up uh on your google uh, you're going to search movie color palette for me right here i've already searched and this is the results i'm getting so you're going to choose if it's uh your favorite kind of movie you can look it up in uh, google and try to search its specific palettes and it will show up but for me i'm just gonna go ahead and give you quick examples with this movie uh grading palettes that are already here so i've downloaded uh some two palettes uh, this for instance and after downloading this you're going to save it in your desktop i have mine here after saving it in your desktop you realize that it's a png format or maybe a jpeg you are going to next take it to photoshop and in photoshop you are going to first make sure that you crop it like for instance you see right here i have mine cropped already if i control z you can see the results before cropping so you want to crop it first and make sure uh, that it's only the frame with the color grading that you want to go for because that's what we are trying to uh, copy so after this you're going to go ahead and click file and save your image or your file as .tga because this is the format that speedgrid reads it's called taga so this is the format that you want to save your project on and save it on your desktop i'm not going to do this because i've already saved mine on the desktop so right away i'm going to head back to my speed grade i'm gonna minimize that head back to my speed grade right here and i'm going to click on um let me click on this clip right here just to make uh these uh options uh possible so i'm gonna i'm going to click on look and immediately click on look you see uh the 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 the, the files that i exported from Sh photoshop right here so i'm going to choose this if i click on it it's going to show up on the side here and it's going to have uh, an impact to my image immediately i do this next step here so right here on the right there's a button here called match look to master and uh, play it so you want to click on this button and immediately you click this button the magic happens so this color grade right here is simultaneously and instantly copied on this footage 
and though it's not perfect and i i cannot say it it can't be perfect unless it uh, unless the shots that i'm copying my footages from are almost the same that one will give will give you great results but because this one looks like someone is on mass and i'm on my i'm on my studio doing a tutorial of course it can't match that uh that much but uh this is a, this is an example of how you can instantly copy a color grade and immediately bring it uh to your uh uh, uh disposal so after this probably you want uh you don't have everything on place but remember you can always do some adjustments here and there you can maybe uh, bring down the saturation just to tone it down a little bit maybe you can play with you know you can play with contrast highlights and all that so you can have your 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 results coming out right away from uh, this place maybe I can pump pump up some uh, uh, some colors here maybe I can balance try balance it just to get what I have and if you check here on the left side where it's written auto color match this is actually the color grade that we've applied and you see if I release it you see it shows clearly that there is a difference there so let me just give you an example on the next one I'm just gonna control Z and get this color out of the way for a minute so there we go we have our flat image again so when i click this other uh, uh file it will appear on my on the right here of my footage and once again i'm going to go ahead and click uh, this magic button and immediately the grade is transferred to my footage and this obviously is too much and this sometimes can be unusable so you want to go with something that is almost related and is almost matching the same uh, uh how do you call it the same environment of which you're copying the grade you want to make sure that you are uh you the footage that you want to color grade is almost of the same environment from the one that you are using to copy the grade itself so this system is powerful and it's uh it works great when the shots actually match in terms of environment and in, in terms of lighting. Let's say maybe I chose this, you see, and uh, obviously when I click here, it won't fill up on top of that, but it will assume that one and this one will display. So if I chose this and maybe I was having a sunset, like if you could see the light here, this beam of tungsten light behind my uh my uh, you know in my desk right here it brings out the exact color of the sun and that's why I'm telling you like when you have things that match in your shot with the actual shot that you're copying the results will be amazing this is the simple way guys you can copy a color grade from any kind of film and this is going to make it easy for you to achieve some amazing color grade that people hustle every night and day just to get them and before uh, you uh, before you can use this you want to go ahead and click this button here just to save the grade and come back here and click this one and right down here you can see the kind of grades that you've used before so if you want to plan and save this you're going to save it as a lot you're going to right click and export look and immediately this will pop out and after this is popped out you just want to go ahead and click export so if you click export it will ask you on where you want to save it i'll choose desktop and just leave this maybe call this uh lat sample something like that uh, sample with double l i call it lat sample so i'm going to save it to my desktop and immediately it will export and it will save it in a zip file so i have my zip right here if you check in 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 uh, uh, my desktop right here so if i want to use this lat i just uh, know that it's right here and and if i was going to use it in my footage maybe in premiere pro you guys know very well on how to you know uh, uh import your lats and actually use them in premiere pro so basically guys that's it that's how you can quickly and instantly copy grade from any kind of film any kind of uh 
a video that you love or anything uh, that is impressing to you even if you had a photo that you thought maybe it was graded well the color was balanced you can take that photo drop it into photoshop crop the unnecessary places and export is export uh, 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 the, the image or the file in .tga and right away head over to your speed grade match that color and you're going to get great results Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing, smash that like button and leave me a comment below. I will sure do appreciate. Thanks again. See you guys on my next video. Peace.